Choo-choo-choo. <laughs> they say I'm sexy now. You can run for your back up. Then machine gun shells go to your back up. I spray your mama crib and let your ass look for me if it's beef cock and the dump and the drama really mean nothing. <laughs> they say it means nothing, champ. <laughs> Something special. They say Mayweather Pacquiao fighting now. I'm gonna stop saying that because I know you like that fucking Rudy ass nigga. What up, fight world? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. So it looks like rapper, boxing promoter, actor, entrepreneur. He has a show on TV. It's called Power. 50 Cent. 50. Sorry. He spoke out. He was on The Breakfast Club, popular radio station, radio show. And he had some things to say about Floyd Mayweather. He says, in the case of Floyd Mayweather versus Manny Pacquiao, who are now fighting May 2nd, MGM, Las Vegas, he is willing to bet, and he's going to place his bet with Floyd Mayweather. He says he's also willing to wager $1.6 million on Floyd Mayweather beating Manny Pacquiao. He says he's just so focused. He also said that he ran into Floyd, which was the first time in a while that they had a chance to speak. As you guys know, they were good friends. They were, 50 Cent was on basically a regular before Mayweather fights on some of the HBO 24-7 series. And they had a falling out right around the time of the Cotto fight where Mayweather went to jail right after that. They had a falling out, um, I think, over a failed business venture they were going to do. And as a result, they didn't really speak. 50 has constantly taken jabs since then at Floyd Mayweather, like verbally on Instagram, making fun of him, saying... Like, damn, champ, you still can't read. Man, you better pick up a Harry Potter book, nigga. Like, just crazy stuff on Instagram, making funny videos and whatnot. And he said it, he ran into him for the first time. They they got to speak a bit at a Chris Brown show at the Barclays. Um, 50 Cent was a guest. He was like a surprise guest at that show, 50 Cent being from New York. So I think this is, is pretty funny. It's a, a change of heart, it sounds like, for 50 Cent based on what he was saying before, because leading up to before we knew this fight was happening, 50 had said some stuff on record in the media. He was saying things like, I don't think the fight will happen. And he also said Floyd Mayweather, he believes Floyd Mayweather is scared to death of the Pacquiao fight. So now I know a lot of fans are going to turn and be like, what the hell? I thought you were on our side, man. Now you're going to watch certain people switch up. Mark my words. Just li read the comments. You'll, you'll see a, a switch. Like, when he's bashing Floyd Mayweather and talking shit and saying he's, he's scared to death, they're like, yeah, 50 knows his shit. He's scared to death. All right. And then now that he's switching, not even switching, now that he's picking, having to pick and, and who he's going to trust his money with, you're going to see a sudden shift. They're going to be like, man, fuck you, 50. You're a traitor, man. I never even liked your music. Get Rich or Die Trying was your only good album. You'll never be Tupac, man. You suck. Your movies suck. <laughs> he just flip-flopped, just like they did with Alex Ariza. When Ariza was with Pacquiao, he, he was all good, and they were defending his honor. Then he went to Robert Garcia with the Brandon Rios situation, and Brandon Rios was facing Pacquiao. Then they called him a traitor and, and stupid and hated his guts. Now he's with Mayweather even bigger rival, and now they really hate Alex Ariza. So there, I'm pretty sure I'll get comments like that with 50 Cent. I just I just find it funny that when the fight wasn't made, people talked a certain way. And then after the fight did get made and it was finalized and we knew about it, and it was on shots and everything, ESPN, a lot of people are changing their tune. And some people that were picking Pacquiao before are still picking Pacquiao. But you do have a demographic of people that I've seen at least, at least on my channel. I get, you know what I mean, tons of comments on all my videos and whatnot. And they, they're they not speaking the same. Like, it's more scaled back. Like, I've seen people, like, usernames, the same usernames. Before the fight was signed, Mayweather's a pussy, he's a bitch, he's a coward, chicken of the year, KFC, Floyd, gay runner, gay weather, all of that. And then the fight gets made. And they've toned it down a bit. They're being more realistic with their predictions. Like some people beforehand, before the fight was announced, they said it will never fight because if it did, Mayweather will get knocked out in the first round and the first second of the first round and crazy stuff like that. Now the fight is made. They may still be picking Pacquiao, but it's a lot more toned down. It's more reasonable. It's like, oh, it'll be a good fight, but I see Pacquiao winning a decision. You know what I'm saying? And 
me, I don't care. Like I said, May 2nd is Judgment Day. We're going to see who's who and what's what. So I don't really care. You guys can side with Pacquiao, side with Mayweather, side with Nunn, side with Canelo. I don't really give a shit because it doesn't change anything I'm doing. It doesn't put money in my bank account. And we're all entitled to our opinion. But the only thing I ask is just support your opinion. Be realistic. Some of y'all saying that dumb shit. Like, I've already been on record saying it's a good fight. I never badmouth Pacquiao. I never badmouth Floyd Mayweather. It's a good fight. It's still a fight that needs to happen in the public once. So be it. But it's it's mighty funny to me because I'm noticing people are being a lot more... Um, not everybody. There's still some fucking lunatics out there. But there's a lot of people I've seen turn where you either don't see them or hear from them at all. Or they're kind of doing like 50 Cent where he said, oh, I think Mayweather's scared to death. Now he's willing to wager over one million, over one million dollars on Floyd Mayweather saying he's too focused and he just can't go against the champ. So it's funny how people's perception changes when shit gets real. Let me know what you guys think. Floyd Mayweather is fighting Pacquiao May 2nd. We will get a conclusion. And rapper 50 Cent, promoter 50 Cent said he's willing to wager and bet $1.6 million on his former friend slash acquaintance, whatever they are now. He says $1.6 million is probably how much he's willing to wager for Floyd Mayweather getting the victory. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you like my video as always. Hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video, it's Ego signing off. Mm -hmm.